Welcome Capricorn Aquarius to your end of the month reading for December. Hope your friends are doing great out there. Welcome back all subscribers and anyone new to my channel. Welcome, welcome. If your friends like this, please like and subscribe and happy holidays to everyone. Hope your holiday season is filled with joy and delight. Okay. And getting straight in here to your energy. This is what you're thinking, feeling all the energy surrounding you. And remember, if this doesn't resonate with you, you can go watch your regular Aquarius or <clears throat> your regular Capricorn reading or your rising or your moon. Capricorn Aquarius. Here we go, guys. We have <laughs> secrets. Illusion, secrets, fantasies. Um, is your person fantasizing? Are you fantasizing? Desires, illusions, disillusion. Okay, let's see what's going on over here. Clarify on the moon. This card's not only going to clarify on the moon, but the entire reading Ooh, right away. Patience. Patience, my dears. Patience. Okay, so getting straight into the situation. The situation is going to take place. It feels like a patience for some kind of secret desire that's going on over here. Secret crush, maybe, perhaps. Let's find out in a second. Situations taking place, I'm sorry, in the present, the near past, and the near future. Obstacles and challenges at this time. You're not going to go into hermit mode no more. You're like, I'm done. It feels like you already have the resolution that you need, and it feels like it was patient. So you're just going to patiently wait. Financial and material changes in the in the near past. And the throat chakra is upside down in the near future with discontent and boredom. So there is something going on over here. It feels like your financial and material changes have changed. They're not coming in the way you want them to. They've slowed down. Something changed about this. You could have changed work. It could just be something just as well as that. Passionate about the changes. So the financial uh, material changes are upside down. Um, I feel like you just weren't passionate about them anymore. You They lost their luster. Um, I think it's work. I think you changed work. Yeah, it looks like you're out traveling around looking for a new job. Um, yeah. Putting a new, new resume somewhere, looking for something better, um, better opportunities, things that are better for you. This is probably why you are dreaming of a new job. Yeah, there was no passion again. Um, this wasn't giving you the stable foundations that you wanted. Uh, work might have been up and down all over the place, but however it is, it's not good. Um, it's not giving you the money that your family needs. Um, and yes, okay, so yeah, with the star card, you are dreaming. There's that dreaming. Dreaming of something better uh, for your family, for yourself, for your firm foundations. Your firm foundations are not doing good. Your financial changes are, yeah, you're not making the money that you need. So you're dreaming of a new job, looking for a new job, wishing upon a star for a new job. It's causing nothing but obstacles and challenges. This job, yeah. There's a lot of pushing and negotiating and compromising about when you're going to work, when you're not going to work, when you're doing this, when you're doing that. Um, it could even cause some problems within the firm foundations of your own household. If you're married or with someone else, it could be with an Aquarius um, or in anything, you know, like yourself, um, or it could be with a Sagittarius and Aries or a, a Capricorn or a Sag Cap uh, Cusp. However it is, it's not doing good for your family or yourself. Could cause fighting and arguing and compromising amongst the family um, with obstacles and challenges because this money is not moving. This dream is not moving. The obstacles and challenges are not going away at this time. There's no money coming in with um, no offering of money with the Knight of Pentacles. Um, but you are hopeful for this new job to come through, um, this new opportunity. Yeah which is something you're going to love. Um, I do feel like you put out a lot of resumes. Um, 
And this is why you're not in hermit mode anymore, because you do believe that this job will come through. Um, yeah. Right now, you, yeah, you have so many opportunities. I see a lot of opportunities knocking at your door right now, um, Cap Aqua. So, yeah, and it's going to be something that you really do love, something you have manifested. You might be a little dis disillusioned on the money that you might be making. Maybe they're telling you that you're going to make this much money, but that might not be the starting cost. So there could be a secret to this job um, that is disillusioned to you. So you might have heard that, you know, you make, you know, at starting, they might, or they might not even say at starting, they might just say this job, you make, you know, $65,000 a year. And in actuality, the starting is, you know, $45,000 a year. So there might be something a little hidden about the job. Um, but you're not thinking about it too much, you're not going into hermit mode. Um, there is a little bit of chaos and overwhelmingness going on around you, and I think it's waiting for this job to come through. Um, could be dealing with a Scorpio who is just not as patient as you are, and you might be telling them, patience, dear, you know, we need to be patient. Things don't just happen overnight. Um, and they might just be seeing it as because the money is not coming through the way it's supposed to, the jobs are not coming through, um, and you've put out a lot, um, yeah, it's overwhelming them and they feel a little chaotic. Yes, overwhelming. And that's because of money. Yeah, because of prosperity is with the imprints. You might have children and you're trying to feed your children and it's hard, right? It's really hard, especially during the holiday season, um, trying to switch jobs over. Okay, so really waiting for that job to come through or whatever the situation is for you. Um, I do not really see love in this situation. This is more of, has something to do with finances and career. If you're waiting for that couch to come in, it could be material. Um, it might not be here for Christmas. Um, okay, because there's some kind of secret factor going on that the place cannot get it out. And maybe it's because of lockdown. Maybe it's because they do not have it ready. They do not have enough drivers. Something to this point. Okay. But they do have the opportunities to get to you sooner or later, right? <laughs> yeah, sooner or later, but it's overwhelming you, and it can be overwhelming your wife, yourself, or your children, um, not getting some kind of something that you want, right? Um, but it does feel more career for everybody. The Queen of Pentacles, there is no communication between you and the Queen of Pentacles, and I do believe that this is this, whatever job this is that you're putting this resume out for. The Queen of Pentacles is representing the job itself, taking on a um, kind of like a life of its own because it has its own energy. Um, so no, uh, no communication, excuse me, I'm trying to put my sleeves up. Got a little warm in here. No communication for you just yet, Capricorn, um, on the cap side of you. And this is, you know, what you were hoping for. I'm still kind of leaving you out in the cold because you're wondering what is going on, but you're still very determined to hear from them. Um, with the discontent and boredom. Yeah, that the emperor coming up. The boss has not called yet. Um, it feels like they're just sitting on their throne and you're just wondering, are they just sitting on my resume? Um, how come they haven't said anything to me just yet? Um, King of Pentacles coming up. Yeah, you really want this job. Um, and it is causing discontent. Your money is rolling in a little bit better. Um, it could be for somebody else. Is a grandparent or did you get some Christmas money, a Christmas bonus? Um, are you still working for some of you you're still working at the old job, even though they're not giving you money, something of this nature feels like there is some money coming in somehow or another, but it's not the money that you're looking for because you're still discontent because you don't have that job just yet. Uh, King of cups upside down, still feeling a little over emotional about the prosperities, but it does feel like you have some, whoa, six of wands coming in, which will put you back into hermit mode. Having the realizations about the victory that you're looking for. Is this job going to do anything? No, they're in a delay and a procrastin. You feel like they're procrastinating against you. Yeah. So it's like, you know it's sitting there. How come you're not really contacting me? You're probably going to have to contact them again to get some answers from them. Yeah. Take the leap of faith for the Ace of Cups because your Ace of Cups is upside down. Um, it's almost like they, your paperwork may have got lost in the mail or in the email. I 
didn't go through. They might even tell you that it didn't go through. We didn't get your email. What? But then you're going to get a different message from a different person, which is going to make you feel like the Nine of Pentacles. But it is not the job that you absolutely want. Because uh, the Little Fortune is upside down, so it feels like it's not directly in your favor. I, it feels like the paperwork or the text message or whatever you did was not received on time. You got lost. But you do have another person messaging you, which will make you feel happy. But it's just not the fate and the destiny that you wanted. It wasn't the desire you're looking for. It's not the same one. It was almost like you were looking for a certain one and it wasn't that one. It was like, you know, I put in a resume for, you know, Sears and then I put one in for O'Reilly or something, you know what I mean? And I didn't really want the O'Reilly one. I wanted to work at Sears and O'Reilly called, right? So it's like that. And I don't know. It's not exactly what exactly you wanted, but it still makes you feel better with the Nine of Pentacles. Why? Because you're still going to feel like you are getting the money that you need because the other money, or money, the other job was had a lot of drama and flip-flopness. It feels like, yeah, it's unjustified. They just could not keep you working and keep you satisfied. Okay, so let's see what the angels have to say. So it does look like you're going to do a lot better um, after the new year. Um, this is going to probably be taking place within at least the end of January, coming into almost February for this new job to come in, guys. Okay. So, clarify on Aqua for me, please. Messages for Cat Aqua. Peaceful resolution will be occurring for the new year. So no matter what, you'll still kind of get your, your dream and your new year's resolution. Um, it's just not exactly, like I said, the place you really want it to be. Uh, meditation brings answers. You're in the waiting game. Yeah, be patient because you're in the waiting game. Um, yeah. Okay. But yeah. Otherwise, it looks like everything's going to be fine. And that was it for you, my friends. And until next time, peace and love. Bye-bye.